Master! More speed! Increase speed! More arms! Archers, we need you! Use arrows! Kinthos ruins. This is where I'll find Podarkis' weapons and supplies. Someone over there? <laughs> what the? Looks like an intruder! You there! Stop!
A supply crate should destroy these without attracting attention. For Darkis's troops will be helpless. Break their supplies, break their will. Rebelling was this much fun. That should do it. Kiro will want to hear about this. Mykonos is a lot busier than Kefalonia. Marcos would like it here. I don't want to be spotted here. Is it done? Podarkis' guards will have to fight with their fists and on empty stomachs from now on. Excellent. 
So, what will you do once Podarkis is dead and the rebellion is won? The sad truth is I have no idea. For as long as I can remember, every day has been a struggle to live, to love. Vengeance has all but consumed me. And what will Alexios do once this is over? We have a lot in common. I was hoping when the smoke clears, we could find somewhere quiet. And what exactly do we have in common? I know you've struggled to get where you are. You've had to fight and claw for everything you have. I know, because I've done the same. We're survivors. I'm glad the gods brought you to our source, Alexios. Some time alone would be nice. You must have many tales. It's time we got going. When Podarkis learns of what happened on Nilos, he'll want revenge. And the first to suffer will be the Dillians. Here. The Athenians are weak. Now we strike Podarkis where he'll hurt most. His kidneys? <laughs> <laughs> it's good to see you, Kira. Since you came here, I've actually started to believe we can win this rebellion. So, you were saying we strike? Guards protect the island's treasury in one location. If we find it and steal it, the soldiers go unpaid, unfed, and unarmed. Podarkis will finally be vulnerable. Then we can stick our blades in between his ribs, feed his liver to the dogs. Before we start feeding organs to animals, can you get me to the nation's purse? Our spies have located it in Miltiadis' fort. I'll have Praxos gather the troops. It's best if it's just the two of us. Easier to sneak in and out undetected. You just want me all to yourself, don't you? <laughs> Let's get going then. Victory is close. I can feel it. We haven't won yet. The fort will be treacherous, and the gods can be fickle. It was the gods who sent you to me. I refuse to believe they'd send you here to die. So what do you think of our islands? I think I prefer Mykonos. They really don't like you shedding blood on Mykonos. <laughs> the priests are so terrified of desecrating the sacred grounds of Apollo. Women about to give birth are sipped over to Mykonos. What happens if they don't make it to shore? Both the babies. The nation's treasure, ripe for the picking. Try to stay out of sight. Guards everywhere. I need to be careful. This fort has seen better days. They should have spent some of that silver on upkeep.
Many brothers were lost to the Athenian dogs. But we are still here. The Battle of the 300. Leonidas was lucky to have that many men. Today, we honor the fallen. Today, we send our enemies to Hades. Kira will fight and die for her pit. Alexios, I didn't think you'd come here after calling my plan a suicide mission. And miss your speech? Never. Athenians give speeches. Spartans give orders. Your men are brave, but they won't be enough. We need those reinforcements. They'd never get here alive. The Athenian navy is too powerful, and our ship is at the bottom of the sea. Mine isn't. You'd confront them in open waters? Not sure if you're brave or just mad. The Adrestia and I have faced greater challenges than a few Athenian ships. You fight like Achilles reborn. But even you couldn't defeat the entire navy. But if I sink enough ships, the Spartans can get through. There's something else. A helmet was left on board my ship. It was my butters. I'll sink the ships. But I'm not making any promises about a helmet. You've been here long enough. How many ships protect Delos? You'll never sink them all. We just need to punch a hole in their patrols, enough to send them scrambling. So the helmet from your pater means a lot to you? It does. He prided from his pater on the battlefield of Thermopylae. The sea is a big place. Where did your ship sink exactly? Somewhere off the northern coast of Mykonos. We could see Miltiadis' fort as we swam to shore. The sharks will have full bellies when I'm done. Nation's treasure, ripe for the picking. I should watch my step around here. kept the doll Kira made for him. She engraved it with the letter P for Potter. <laughs> Could Kira have known all along? The rebels deserve the truth as well. But blood is everything to some people. They could abandon her if they knew Podarkis was her father.
Where's Kira? She's... Miss me already, Mistios? Kira, there is something I need to tell you. That look on your face, so serious. Sit, relax, drink some wine. What I'm about to say is for you alone. Follow me. Now that you have me all alone, what is it you want to tell me? <sighs> there is no other way to say this. Odarkis is your father. <laughs> what sort of joke is this? This isn't a joke. I will kill you where you stand! This can't be. Kira, I'm sorry. He took everything from me. How did you find this? I found your old house. I know about your mother. I can still hear her screams. A storm of blue armor and red blades tore through our home. I had to run through Mater's blood to escape. I never returned to that place. It was best you didn't. It's good you told me in private. The men don't need to know this, not yet. But please, leave me for a while. I need to be alone. Doing recon on the Athenians, I take it. Anything a mercenary can help with, spy? Followers of Ares are operating at a shrine in that cave, Mistyos. They've been making locals disappear. I've made a person or two disappear in my time, but they deserved it. I've written a report detailing their position on this papyrus for my commander, but I can't let them slip away while I deliver it. You want me to deliver it to the Spartan commander? That's exactly it. Will you do it for me? I'm in. Thank you. This must be done carefully. I should get going. A man told me you needed this. Perfect timing, Mistyos. Let me repay you. <sighs> huh. 
Chiare, is there something you need? My play. The whole audience was terribly afflicted. Everyone cried. I write too well for my own good. You don't seem happy about that. The play has been banned for causing too much suffering. The soldiers are keeping my draft in their camp. I wish it never existed. I've even been fined. I don't know how I'll pay. So you want me to give you some drachmi? Yes. Any drachmi you can give helps. All right, here it is. They'll be on high alert here.
Alexios, there you are. Good news, I hope. When the people of Delos discovered Podarkis lost every coin of their nation's treasure, ha, they're going to rip him to pieces. You weakened Athens' grip over Delos, exposed Podarkis, and made way for a Spartan alliance. I could kiss you. I don't see anything holding you back. <sighs> you breathed life into me. If only you'd arrived on Delos before Thaletas. You and Thaletas? But the way you were at each other's throats in the cave. He's a stubborn, arrogant, glory-hungry Spartan. But behind all the bronze and brawn, there's a man I could see by my side when this is all over. If we survive. The two of you fighting Athenians on the beach sounds romantic. I'd hate to interfere. We should probably move. They're going to come looking for us. I don't think I've ever really said thank you for coming here. You've given us hope. I'll go back to the hideout. But if you keep this up, Podarkis is as good as dead. I may finally know peace. for Kira. Not here. Gone hunting. Wants you with her, she said. I mean, where is she? Praying to the gods for a good hunt. The altar of Artemis, east from here, on the north bit of Tavern Point. Thanks. Denied Artemis, guide my bow. I pray to you with all my heart, and Alexios doesn't scare off the animals with his heavy footsteps. I thought I was being quiet. If that was you being quiet, we'll have nothing but trampled grass to eat for dinner. Nice altar. The flowers remind me of sweeter days. But your real concern should be, how skilled are you with that bow? I don't need to pray to the gods to hit my targets. <laughs> They've been known to disguise themselves as animals. I just like to warn them I'm coming. Because I always hit my targets. Sounds like a challenge. Come, the Ibex is swift. We're not going to catch any by standing and chatting. There's a spot down here where I used to hunt as a young girl. It was hunt or starving those days. Same for me. I started by catching and cooking rodents. <laughs> they make a good soup. But look how far you've come. 
how far we've come. Now show me how to use that bow. This was a great idea. I'm glad you invited me. I'm glad you accepted. Your form is perfect. With the bow? That too. My people will be well fed, and the gods will have their sacrifice, thanks to you. You're a great hunter. Why did you actually want me here? Don't be naive. There's something between us, even though I know I shouldn't act on it. Because you love the us. Or at least I thought I did, until you arrived. The hunt clears my mind, to reflect on the words that passed between us. Is that a good thing? I know a spot down by the water. It's quiet. We'll be alone. What do you say? I'm all yours. There's no Ebexes here. Billions have suffered for so long. This is the first time I've felt happiness since the war began. You can bring that to your people. These islands deserve peace. So do you. And what about you? When this is all done, we could always use another set of capable hands. My journey isn't over yet, but I may settle down someday. You can do many things, Mistyos, but settle down? I'm not so sure. Another challenge? <laughs> <laughs> uh, no. So the pirate has one blade at my throat and one at my stomach, and he says, 
How do you want to die, Mistyos? Fast or slow? My gods, what did you do? He was so focused on me, he never noticed my spear in his leg. He was dead before he knew what happened. His leg? A little trick my mother taught me. Why is it so easy to talk with you? Because we've lived similar lives, been through similar struggles, even though we grew up so far apart. I want you, Alexios. Here, now, under the stars. I've wanted you since I laid eyes on you. Mykonos is definitely my favorite island. <laughs> and you're my favorite, Mistyos. Thaletas should know about this. He will, in time. For now, he needs to focus on the rebellion. So do we. 